What we do at Breck that I think is a little bit unusual, we have working artists as our teachers. And what they do is they bring their style as a studio artist into the classroom. And hopefully when it gets going really well, everybody's an artist. I'd always had this class before do a life-size self-portrait. Self-portraiture is a very traditional genre. I mean, I think as long as people have drawn, there's been this sense of, well, who am I? On the one level, there's all the investigation of who am I. On another level, as an artist, who are you with that never abandons you? Who's going to sit? Normally, I don't like drawing myself, but the more you do it, the more comfortable you become with it. It just makes you more comfortable as an artist as well. We start with little kids. You can do this. You can look at yourself. And they might feel like they don't have the confidence, but if you can help them figure out how to look, that's really what it is. It's how to open up their eyes. And they see really well. What I try to do as an art teacher at Breck School is help children learn how to make creative choices that will tell the world who they are. How do you yeah. want people to see you? How do you make something alive? How does it read so that there's, there's a character in there? And a character that has something to say to someone else in the world. Breck is a really exceptional place. If you walk into this art department here, it's alive. It's a studio. But you go into the science lab, they're thinking like scientists. Everywhere you turn at Breck, it's alive and engaged and vital.